All right. Hello, everyone. My name is Dan, and today we're gonna do a different type of video. I mean, this is still gonna be in uh, the drawing section of my YouTube channel, speed drawings or whatever. But um, yeah, it's pretty calm. Pretty calm day. It's actually snowing outside. I'm actually I have a plate of food next to me. I'm about to eat that while I talk to you guys about something. I want to talk about meeting one of my best friends because this is a drawing for him. This is his birthday gift. Um, this is like what a few days late, but I already gave it to him when it was like kind of incomplete and it was like kind of ready, but it wasn't detailed. Um, my best buddy is Jordan. You probably seen him in uh, a few YouTube videos. Like probably my friends that see this like video, they know who Jordan is. And for new people looking at this video, like, ooh, this is a cool drawing. I drew him this picture of his characters, me and him made together. Uh, without him, I probably would have not like become an artist that I wanted to be. I probably probably wouldn't be into Sonic how I am now, and I probably wouldn't have made one of my characters at all without his help. So thank you again, Jordan. You don't know how much, how like grateful I am for meeting you actually, really. Am. And uh, we met during junior high school. After me leaving elementary school, you know, junior high school life started in seventh and eighth grade. I met him in the lunchroom and we hit it off because we both liked Sonic. And at that moment in time, I gave up on liking Sonic and he rekindled my love for the series. He even got me into Paper Mario and he told me how he finished it and how fun the game was. The story was good. I was able to play that. And that was just like a beautiful moment because like I hate reading in games. Now I can, I, I love that. I love RPGs and all that stuff. Without Jordan, I probably wouldn't have gotten into the Paper Mario series. Then we, um, okay. one day, oh my gosh. Billy just ruined everything. I, I'm gonna leave this in because it's gonna be funny. But, uh, goddamn Billy. So, uh, around the time where our friendship started growing, we, we drew together, we drew Sonic together, we made a bunch of comics. And one day, my mom's job, I had a, like a Saturday program to go to, and they offered a trip to a um, college. And I asked Jordan to come along with me. And of course his mom said yes and that was the first time my mom and his mom met each other and Jordan's pretty tall dude and we had fun on that trip but that same exact day I got Luigi's Mansion for 3DS now these characters in this picture right now I'm drawing Jack one of Jordan's characters these characters are inspired off of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon and Jordan made ghost characters and they can turn into humans with the help of a certain character named Goo, which is the main ghost of the rest of them, and my character Dan, right there, if you see him. Goo is at the top of the book. Um, we were inspired by Luigi's Mansion so much that we made a little comic series. I would show you pictures, but he has the books. I actually checked before recording this video. He actually has the books. Hold on, let me see. Food's getting cold. Can't have that but we had like three part series of the comic where Dan stumbles across the mansion and he meets up with this ghost named Goo that gets thrown out of the mansion and he has to save his uh, family and of course you see how everyone's ha happy in this picture these pictures that I've been drawing this whole picture everyone's happy without Dan they wouldn't like be the same they were controlled by this big bad boss ghost. Now, I forgot the name. I really don't care about him. Me and Jordan do not care about that character. We even said if we made a fourth comic, it probably looked better than all the other ones because we were young at that moment. But we wouldn't bring that mofo back. Not to mention when I was doing that comic, at the end, the third one didn't make any sense because apparently Kirby came out of nowhere. <laughs> And, and Dan and Jordan and Human Goo came out of nowhere and beat the boss ghost, so it was ridiculous. The ending comic didn't even make no sense, but the, the rest of the story that happened in was pretty good, I want to say. But the ending made no sense. It really did. Kirby. Kirby. Literally Kirby. That don't make no sense. But the boss ghost, 
we will not bring him back because it made no sense. He was just in the series for no reason. To be like a King Boo ripoff. And it was a it was a fun time. I'm really grateful drawing stuff with him. We drew more comics than just Luigi Mansion inspired stuff. But we destroyed Luigi's Mansion 2. And we played it online so much that we were just so we were so in, so inspired. Um and for that matter, I didn't I really didn't know that Jordan was that big of a fan of Luigi's Mansion. I just remembered that when I went to his aunt's house. No, no, not even his aunt. Um Jordan, you know, cousin Holly. Um I remember you showed me the the, the um the GameCube Luigi's Mansion disc, so you did complete Luigi's Mansion the first one. God damn, why is everyone yelling? I'm trying to goddamn record. So basically I never really noticed how big of a fan you were for Luigi's Mansion, so that's that that's a given. And you know, I've beaten the game on my channel already, but I've beaten multiple times. And I don't know, man. Is there something about Luigi's Mansion, the series as a whole, it just drew us closer together? I'm not gonna lie and be like Sonic drew us closer together because he did. But Luigi's Mansion, you making your own characters, and you just I don't know. There's like so much to say, but like, you inspired me so much to, to keep drawing, like, it's so crazy. All these characters you made, all the things you've done, you pushed me to draw more. And when, when we separated and I went to high school, it was difficult because like, I didn't have you there. I didn't tell you that, but like it was very difficult making new friends, and I did. And I met like Jade, Daniel, Aaron, uh, Katana, uh, and everyone else, and it was cool. Teresa, everyone, but just without you, it just lost flavor because we spent so much time together. So me being a part of me was just like kind of weird. But still, we started hanging out. You came to my house to spend a night. We kept drawing. We kept playing games. We played old games. We played DS together. We still played even Luigi's Mansion 2 from time to time, and now we're playing Luigi's Mansion 3 right now. So I think I want to kind of stream it with you, we can play together, hopefully some some of our other friends get it too so we can play that together, because that'll be fun. It's like so much I want to say, but like it's crazy. That's why I wanted to whip up a drawing for you because like I haven't seen you draw these characters in, in years and it'll be a shame that you have these characters and don't like don't do anything with it. But like I understand if you don't want to draw that much because you, you're busy, I'm busy, everyone else is busy. You know how it is. So it's I don't know. But regardless of that, the drawing's almost done and you got the incomplete version, Jordan, but now you're already seeing what the real one's gonna look like. I'm it, it I'm glad it came out actually pretty good, better than what I'd hoped, and I'm grateful for everything that you helped me with, and I'm grateful that I even met you, and I'm grateful that you spend time with me still, and we're still even friends to this day. Uh, we spent a lot of time, we like same YouTube channels, we, we played Michael Jackson Experience, we played a lot of games that are similar, we both like Sonic, and we both have similar drawing styles since we drew together since we taught each other things that we found out before and we're just such good friends and i don't want to see you always sad all the time i kind of want to see you happy like how you're smiling right now in the picture how i drew you i want to see you happy like how you used to be and you, you usually act depressed now and i just kind of want you to get back how you was before and i know that's hard but i just hope that this drawing could be something special that you can look back on and be like, yeah, 